In the nearly three weeks since Norfolk Police Chief Larry Boone's departure was announced, Boone has remained quiet about what happened and what led to him retiring. And now we're hearing from inside the department about what's going on in his absence. A source tells News 3, quote, the tension has gotten even worse. The source tells News 3 Boone had faced pushback from some of the rank and file within the department when he promoted more diverse officers into senior positions. And now with Boone out of the picture, the source tells News 3, quote, instead of white and black officers working together in the past, continuing, quote, what we're seeing now, that communication and that closeness of working together, regardless of what our issues are, has dissipated. News 3 reached out to the police department's public information office to see what they have to say about morale in the department, but didn't hear back. We also reached out to Mike Lynch, a police officer and president of the Norfolk chapter of the Virginia Police Benevolent Association. He didn't respond either, but earlier this month, he addressed morale in an interview with News 3. Morale is kind of low, uh, supervision, the officers don't trust the supervision. When you have officers that don't trust their own supervisors, that's an issue. It's an issue the department will have to confront with a new police chief. Former police chief Mike Goldsmith is stepping back into his role as acting chief. And as Boone officially retires this week, the city council will decide tomorrow whether to approve giving him nearly $308,000 in additional retirement compensation.